away from YouTube, social media. I had the baby boy, man. <laughs> Boys will be making for my son. Ah! I don't want to be showing my face, man. Let's show some interesting stuff, man. So I've been working on lots of projects, and this video is just a quick overview. So basically, I got my Tesla motor. Look, oh, I'll be hacking this thing. So I'll be replacing the logic board here and unlocking the Tesla motor for up to 450 kilowatts, man. So the Tesla P100D is actually using about. Uh, in ludicrous mode, I think it's 360 or 370 kilowatts on a large drivetrain. Yeah, so imagine the power going to be running here, right? So it can actually be set up to 470 kilowatts, but things start to become a bit unreliable, so you're going to stop at 450 kilowatts. So imagine this thing on a go-kart. I'm really considering putting this in a go-kart. So yeah, I'm setting up a Patreon, man. Eh? Patreon! <laughs> So if you can help with two dollars, one dollar, five dollar, ten doleta, please give me some hand there. <laughs> so gonna need a 400 volt battery capable of running this monster, man. <laughs> so yeah, I might need some extra income from my subscribers to say some stupid stuff like that. And I want to put lots of detailed videos, and I'll give a lot of information away. So that's gonna be a trade, right? <laughs> So, and then I've got a Tesla subframe that I'm refurbishing here. I want to show exactly what I'm doing here. I'm cleaning up some things and fixing that side of the subframe. Those are minor damage. Uh, they always snap in the same spot. So it's actually designed to break safe, right? Yeah, so I've got some speakers here, man. I have this thing sitting here for nine years waiting for projects. I'm like, I'm gonna make a big boom box, man. <laughs> high power and here I got my trike I need to make some burnout videos man <laughs> I found a place where I can do some burnouts without being trouble, man. With, with cops. <laughs> this is very loud. <laughs> and then yeah, what I got here? So I got the slow motor, man. So I'll do a little demonstration here. <laughs> I'll be making a go-kart with this first and then I'm gonna be putting the Tesla drive train <laughs> so I'm gonna start with this first right so slow motor big powerful actually very small for the power we're gonna be pumping here ASI accelerated system back 8000 monster controller man <laughs> so this one can actually put 800 phase amps through these wires here make this motor sweat Whoa gonna have to keep up with that man so this is the brain this is the this is where it pumps all the power to the motor and sucks all the energy from the batteries man that's the brain that's the magic man ah so here i've got a very powerful lipo battery very compact i'm gonna be you can put this thing in a backpack man very safe aluminium electrical case that i was like hmm i actually can fit 20 cells in series here and make this thing a, a powerhouse <laughs> So this is 84 volts, 25 amp charger, and this can charge this battery at 45 minutes, man. Pretty fast. Ooh, I'm gonna hook up a BMS, a battery management system. Often people, uh, when they see LiPo and high power setup, they think they need to hook up uh, RC chargers and connect everything here, like individually, to, every time you're gonna charge. I wanna make a video showing how to hook up a regular battery management system and treat them like a normal battery. So you don't have to go with 18650 batteries. You can go with high power monsters like this. <laughs> and yeah, so here's some the best balancing chargers I've ever had. They're not regular balancing chargers. They actually 
for like battery repairing jobs. Yeah. I think that the best tool I've ever had to fix batteries. But this is a discontinued model. It's from like four or five years ago when, when I bought it. So this can handle six series. The new ones, they can handle nine series. It's a lot better, 50% bigger. I need to buy the new one, make a video review. All these things, I need a Patreon just to help with a little, you know, cash so I can buy tools, buy a BMS, all this stuff, right? So and then what else I got here? Oh, I got my Fang parts. People always ask, hey, bro, I'm gonna make videos about my Fang. <laughs> I got some parts here. I can make some videos, man. So BBS HD, BBS BBSO2, BBS01. I used to fix these things every day. I'm very familiar with them. Oh, this was from my bike, man. Good memories. <laughs> and that's damaged as well. <laughs> you might not be able to see. So there's lots of damaged parts here. I've been keeping just for like a little tutorial or something that I might be making one day. Yeah, there's more parts here. And yeah, lots of battery management systems failed man they're all destroyed all these ones here they're faulty man i had to replace them every single one and there was like maybe like three times more bms's that i replaced in along two years you know yeah so i can talk why they fail why they fail man where they fail is this a poor cell design or poor electronics design like why why man why they're so nasty why there's so many here man why <laughs> And yeah, so I can talk about multimeters as well because I got so much, so much stuff here. Eh? Why do I have one, two, three, four, five? <laughs> Why do I have so many multimeters oscilloscope here? And this is probably my favorite one. I can make video reviews talking about tools, man. And why do I like, I love this $4 multimeter probes for balancing wires. I can measure batteries with this. Look, this uh, thing like a needle, man. Mm. Oh man, check this rubbish, man. So this is a Abitronic. Oh, that was the rubbishest. This is a fake one. The nastiest thing I bought in my life, man. This thing gives you really horrible electric shocks and it's just nasty, man. Everything falling apart. I got my money back. And yeah, man, but I kept this for a very honest review. Ah, <laughs> prepare yourself. And then this is a little battery tester. So it's 150 watts continuous. So you can actually see how many amp hours or how many watt hours you have in your battery. Because people start using the batteries, they lose the capacity and sometimes they don't have anything to test. Very handy, I pay $29 or something. Yeah, very interesting tool, deserves a video, man. And that's it, I'm gonna keep it short. Ooh, Tesla motor, man. Give me a hand on Patreon, man. Two dollar, two doleta. Patreon. Ah! I'm gonna pull this back, man. Ah!